Huh? I didn't take anything. I didn't even leave the store. Oh, You're just going for a jog? Huh? Just going for a jog? No, I didn't take it though. They have it. 22, 22. Please, sir, please don't do this to me. Please. Show me out with a 65 and come to Walmart. Please, I didn't mean to take anything. Here, come on. Can I just go pay? Give me this. Hey, brother, are you helping in digital? Oh, Alright, come to the car. Are you serious? Please, no. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna do some water on the floor. You can start one, might be three involved. Please don't do this to me, sir. Please don't do this. I didn't do anything. Take a seat. I didn't do anything. Take a seat. Please. Take a seat. Take a seat. I didn't do anything. Take a anything. seat, miss. Miss, take a seat. Why are you take doing this? Take a seat. <laughs> put your feet up. Why are you arresting me? Miss, put your feet up. Why are you arresting me? Put your feet up. I You're being detained for shoplifting right now. I didn't take okay, anything, Okay, then we'll sir. get to the bottom of that. Get in the car. Guys. <sighs> Okay. Yep. Yeah, we'll get that situated in a second. Yep. Incoming message. Please, sir, I'll pay for it, please. Okay, come this way. Oh. Take a seat on that bench over there. Hey, I got the uh, one female in the gray. You guys got the stuff? You bring it over here? Okay. What about the other two? Okay. Do you have anything on them or you don't know yet? Okay, well, okay, well, if you want to grab them anyways, because this one might have the keys for them, so, where they can wait around and see what we do. Probably, yeah. I don't know, she just said she needs to give her mom a key, so, if one of you, if one of you yeah, if one of you could come back here, and then you can have them come back over here. All right. Okay, all right, I'll be in here. Walmart was fine, you can cancel the other unit. Do you have an ID in here, miss? Yeah. Where? In the, um, the, in the Pink wallet? wallet? Pink? Yeah. Okay. Oh, no, it's in my phone, actually, I'm sorry. Okay. No. Right there. Attached? Yeah. Right there. You guys came in one car? Huh? You guys came in one car? Okay. Where is it in here? No, I don't it's see it. Number yet or no? No. Oh! It might take a good 20 minutes. 20, 30 minutes to get a number on that. Okay. Yeah, just have them wait then. Huh? Just All have right. them wait. Yeah. Them. What's your first name? Sarah. Sarah? S A R A? Yeah. H? No H. Middle initial? A. Last name? Melendez. What is it? Melendez. M E? L E. N D E Z. What's your date of birth? 
What's your social? Sir, it's not yeah. six fifteen. It's two fifteen. Oh, sorry. So you said June. No, two fifteen. Eighty-eight. Two fifteen. Oh, two fifteen. Okay, gotcha. Sorry, I got like three radios in my. What's your current address? No, I'm, I'm homeless. Homeless. Take a seat for me. Can you hear me? Uh, if you just want to stand by for a second, try and see whatever the number is, and then it's NCA. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. I'll put you, man. Car accident, bro. Truck driver, I understand. Jeez. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. Hey, so so just real quick, so she had, she paid for only this, and then all this other stuff was in here? Yeah. Okay. Just, when you guys are... Alright, Sarah, we've got to read you something real quick, alright? You have the right to remain silent and not answer any questions. You have the right to the presence of a lawyer of your choice before you make any statement during questioning. If you cannot afford a lawyer, you are entitled to the presence of a court-appointed lawyer before you make any statement and during any questioning. Any statement can and may be used against you in a court of law. Any statement you make must be freely and voluntarily given. If at any time during the interview you do not wish to answer any question, you are privileged to remain silent. I can make no threats or promises to induce you to make a statement. This must be of your own free will, okay? Alright, so what happened today, Sarah? Why were you running when these gentlemen just try to have a conversation with you outside? Huh? Okay. Why did you leave all the property that you said you paid for? I didn't pay for it. You didn't pay for anything? No. You didn't pay for no nothing that you had on your cart? No. No? You just walked out and then you got I scared of them? Huh? They, 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 I left the cart with them and I left. Okay, but you walked out. You walked out. These gentlemen who work for loss prevention tried to stop you and have a conversation with you, and you took off running from. Them. Okay. And did he tell you not to run, or you would go to jail? You remember hearing that? No. Okay. If you have, if you told me you had money to pay for all this stuff, I can even just pay for it. I don't have money. My mom would have to pay for it. And she, I didn't want her to have to pay for it. it was, it was Who else is here with you? My mom and my daughter. And your daughter? Where were they while you were not paying for this stuff? They were shopping. Did they buy their own stuff? I don't know where they are. Just, my mom will definitely buy it. She's not going to steal stuff. Is that what you mean? No, I'm just talking about you. Because we've been watching you guys for a while. You guys were communicating and went your separate ways, and then you decided to go out a different way than where you actually paid for your stuff. You paid on this side, went it back through the aisle, what, 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 what wouldn't work? The card machine wouldn't work. Oh, the card machine or your card? I don't know if it was the card machine or my card. It wouldn't work because I had gift cards and I was going to pay like with a couple of gift cards, but it wouldn't work and I had Walmart gift cards and Visa gift cards on my boyfriend. All right, and this so is your I real. Go find her, but I didn't go find her. What would you do instead? Right. And this is your real name, correct? Yes. Right. Peace. Yeah. I'm not there anymore. So I'm serious. This thing? Yeah. Peace. Okay. Not that purse. That's mine. That's all mine. Those are the keys. Yeah. Can you just give me my purse? Yep. You want to do that? Yep. It'll make everything easier. That's just so hard. Okay. 
Now that we're in here, we're just going to go through everything. So, okay. just to make sure. Establishers? Yes. Whatever it is. About this. Yeah, it's on mine. Huh? Yes, that's on mine. Okay. Okay, so what do you want to take? Just this? Oh, this is all mine here. I'm saying with you. That's what you no, want to take? I don't want to take any of this. Okay, but what about your phone, this wallet? No, I want to go with my mom. All with your mom? All this stuff here. This. Okay, you can have a seat. No, I will, uh, I'll be over there. I'll grab it and I'll give it to you. Yep, come here. The time is 18, 18 hours on June 30th, 2023. I'm Officer Gomez, West Palm Beach Police Department. This is in regards to case number 2023-11393. It's a retail theft, grand theft. I'm here with... Walmart Loss Prevention Manager. What's your date of birth? Raise your right hand for me. Swear that everything you're going to tell me is the truth, whole truth, nothing but the truth. Yes, sir. All right, what happened today? Uh, I was notified by one of my cosmetics associates that she noticed a Caucasian female picking up a lot of items from the cosmetics, so I should keep an eye on her. I then picked her up on um, my CCTV cameras. I watched her for about I want to say 45 minutes, almost close to an hour, where she selected multiple items um, from the jewelry department, cosmetic department, toys department, uh, multiple departments throughout the store. She then made her way to the front of the store where she had she met up with a young lady, and the lady that presumed to be her mom. She then made her way around the store again, back to the tote department, Tupperware department, where she selected two totes from the Tupperware department. She placed all the items that was inside the shopping cart, inside of those totes. She made her way to the self-check out on the grocery side of the store where she attempted to pay for four items, which her debit card... That's on the, the east that's side? That's on the east side of the okay. store, which her debit or credit card didn't go through. Um, she then left, she left the, the um, self-check out on the east side of the store, made her way to the west entrance of the store, um, exited the store um, by, by the grocery entrance, which is the west side of the store, where she was approached by myself and APA Kevin. Um, at which time the, so the subject then flee to the parking lot and so when we got the officer that was on duty which went to retrieve her, brought her back to the AP office which we are Walmart all willing to prosecute for them then. I amounted up to 1000 I think it was like $800 or something like that. Okay. Brought about that figure. Oh, the receipts here you gave me, correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, and uh, the tote Tupperware, that was like a black container? Yes, sir. Okay. All right. Uh, All right, just raise your right hand for me. And you swear that everything you told me is the truth, whole truth, nothing but the truth. Okay. And the, the white female that I detained is the same white female in question? Yes, sir. Okay. All right, this interview is concluded at 1820 hours.